Hi Gemini, it's Elle here to do a quick message. It's titled, uh, What Your Soulmate Wants to Tell You. So your soulmate wants to, maybe you are in separation from someone. You're not speaking, or if you do speak, you guys are not having a real grand conversation. It may be a surface level conversation, but what this is, this reading is about what the soulmate wants to say to you. Wow, your cards are popping out. All right, so what does the soulmate want to say to Gemini? Six of Pentacles. All right. Nine of Wands. Two of Cups. The Emperor. Last card. What does the soulmate want to say? The Magician. And the star card at the bottom of the deck. So, Gemini, what your person wants to say to you is... They have some ideas of what the relationship should be like. And then they have ideas of... They have ideas for the future also. They have an idea that this can be a successful relationship. But there is either a Gemini or the person that they're coming to, the, the soulmate they're coming to, or a significant other they're coming to the reading for, um, sees it differently. Someone is tired of putting in energy, effort, time, money. Someone is saying, I'm keeping the relationship alive. Someone is questioning their path here. Am I on the right path? Am I with the right person? Someone has an idea. What is this about for the Gemini? Uh, we have family. We have unsure. Yeah, someone's unsure. Open, uh, forgive, hidden. Right. So there's someone who has reservations about maybe this this companionship, maybe family. It's taking a toll on what this could be. There's an element of someone being older than the other. Somebody feels like I'm giving more to the situation. It could even be money than the other. It could be time, energy, effort. There's an element of someone taking a step back because it's too much money going out and not enough coming in. That's what I'm hearing. I don't know. There's so many sense. Too much money going out or it's too much energy spent here and not enough where, you know, I, I, there's no middle ground. No one is meeting me halfway. So there might be separation between the two of you. This could be a successful relationship with the two of cups but then there's also an element of someone oh someone needing to preserve themselves and their resources the emperor and the magician someone's at a place of reservation they're trying to still have their their foundation that they built for themselves Someone also feels manipulated. There might be a sense of someone is being manipulative in some fashion. Uh, Gemini said, so your soulmate says, I feel like I'm being manipulated or or that you were, were manipulative. The soulmate says this is a relationship that can or could work, but there needs to be a lot of healing. There needs to be more clarity in regards to what we're working toward because I can't keep carrying the brunt of the relationship, says the soulmate or the significant other. There's someone who's world renowned. There's someone who's built an empire for themselves and they feel like they're being manipulated in regards to where they put their energy, their time, their money, their love. 
what they should be thinking about doing next. They feel like there's heavy manipulation here. And maybe that's why they're taking a step back from you. Gemini or or Gemini is taking a step back from soulmate. I don't know, but the soulmate is saying something about heavy manipulation here. Uh, let's see what this is in regards to. Or someone feels like the Gemini, you are being very manipulative. Or we need to come together and, and create this thing better, says the soulmate. We need to use all of our resources, yours and mine, whether it's money, talent, uh, energy, effort. Can you open up this reading for the Gemini? Uh, something about moderation. Like I said, something about too much money going out, not enough coming in. Not someone's doing too much in regards to carrying the relationship and keeping it afloat. So you could be directly connected to a King of Cups, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Gemini, uh, or Sagittarius. Um, there needs to be balance and compromise before the, before the soulmate comes back to you or comes back together. This can be a successful union, but there needs to be... yeah. Someone needs to start thinking about long-term goals together, not just expanding yourself and expanding your own territory. Wow, the emperor again. It, someone's a, a lot, very much worried about how they look. They're always great body. They may get a lot of compliments on their body. Somebody did work on their body. Somebody paid for the work. Something of, something of that nature. I don't know. Um, or somebody's paying for a body. Someone is doing a lot of work in order to get a, attraction or attention um, by way of, of how they look. Someone is very overly obsessed with how they look. This could be the Gemini that just popped out. This could be someone else. Um, whomever it is, uh, the soulmate is saying there needs to be moderation in all of this. There needs to be moderation in trying to um, just kind of advance yourself. Uh, what about me? What about what what it is I want for the for myself and for the connection? Someone wants someone to get a job. Someone wants someone to start bringing in more money. We have a family is what I'm hearing. Um, yeah, someone, this is definitely, yeah. Let me see. Right, someone wants someone to make the choice. Yeah, you're doing what you love and what you're passionate about and you're being an entrepreneur or whatnot, but you, we need money. I need you to do something more foundational. I need you, we need to make some large purchases and I'm the only one able to do it, says maybe the soulmate um, to Gemini. For a Don, yeah, this is someone saying, look, we need to make, this is large money. Winning the lottery and inheritance. It says, you know, I'm making money, nine of wands, but I'm not about to watch you spend it. Someone is getting passive income also. It could be the Gemini. It could be the other person. Um, someone says, I cannot. I cannot keep doing this. I, I have energetically stopped. Maybe I have stopped the money. Or I'm paying the bills, but I'm not giving you anything extra. Your soulmate is something about money. It's about equality. Somebody's too concerned about how they look. Their own goals. Um, while they're in a relationship this popped out the three of wands in the chariot someone's making long-term goals for self to move self forward in the relationship in the marriage right so the magician somebody is definitely manipulating the access of like I have access to re to resources I'm going to use them so to further me and not be thinking about the entirety of the relationship and everyone else involved. You could be dealing with 
Aries Sagittarius Leo a male cancer someone is saying you can put me in a poor house but I'm not gonna let you your soulmate could be yeah someone saying that I don't see this marriage relationship going much further I'm gonna have to release this carry burden that I I I carry you know I think this person is taking responsibility they want an ending to this they want an ending to either the, the entire relationship or they want an ending to how you guys operate monetarily energetically in a relationship I'm just heard somebody doesn't even clean the house um, and they don't go they don't work or they do part-time work or they work from home or whatever it is they do they they can clean the damn house um, I don't know somebody's upset I don't even get upset in readings what's the advice here what is the advice here for Gemini someone wants to end into this someone says I cannot take care of you and your whole family that came up in another reading for Gemini I believe I don't know what that's about but yeah helpful people there's something better ask for help from others recovery choose a new direction unlikely and in the near future okay so you've got helpful people around you maybe they can help you rectify this situation this is what you need to be focused on Gemini your person is telling you all of this I'm sorry that you know maybe I don't know what the message is and Gemini you would be and it could be the adverse. You could be telling your person this. I can't do all this by myself. Um, choose a new direction. Something's unlikely here. What's unlikely? Three of Pentacles the ace of cups the strength card it's unlikely that you guys are going to get back together some of you it's a, it's a situation of getting back together but somebody says this is too toxic you're already in a marriage or a commitment i don't want to be the other woman where you're not committing to me you're not telling me how you feel you i'm up in the air you pick me up you put me down when you want attention um it's unlikely that this person is going to come back and want to date you or take to any advances from you, Gemini, or vice versa. All right, Gemini, I hope that this reading gave you a bit of clarity about what your soulmate, significant other, wants to say to you. Go over to the website, book your own reading there. Take advantage of the 30-minute phone reading that is on sale, the 72-hour energy reading that is on sale also. Um, also have the one question, one answer or the situation and the advice outcome reading it's under ten dollars take advantage of that if you have uh, that comes to you via email so pull a few cards to you for you and then tell you what they mean all right so gemini take care many blessings to you stay in prayer bye